Hello everyone, welcome to my how-to video on using this Rust-Oleum cabinet restoration kit. And I chose this kit because it looked fairly simple actually, no sanding, and the kit provided uh, pretty much everything you need outside of paintbrushes. And it gives a lot of instruction on what to do. So here is what the box looks like. You can purchase this online with pre-mixed colors, or you can go to like Home Depot or Lowe's where you can pick the color. You just bring this to the paint counter and let them know which color you want. To the left is the color without the glaze coat, and to the right is with the glaze coat. And the glaze coat gives it a deeper, more vibrant color. So I wouldn't suggest anyone to actually skip this step because at $75, this is what makes that $75 worthwhile. And I'll show you an example here with this photo. And the middle, the middle cabinet door is with the glaze coat and all the other ones without it. So definitely take that into consideration. And here's what the kit comes with, your instructional DVD and the manual, the step one uh, deglosser with the um, scrubby, step two with the bond coat, the color you picked, and the decorative glaze, which comes with a cheesecloth for you to wipe the glaze off after you apply it. And then of course you have the protective coat, which provides that waterproofing uh, touch to it. So let's get started. So we're going to do a before walkthrough and we will have our contractor change the top to a white colored quartz top. And as you can see with the cabinets, they're actually in pretty good condition and that's why we decided not to uh, replace them entirely. We're hoping the paint, the new paint color will make it less noticeable that the cabinets don't match.
so this is it this is the end product I hope everyone enjoyed the video uh, this kit saved us around two to four thousand dollars by not having to replace the cabinets directly and in my point of view it looks it looks pretty decent it's not perfect but uh, that probably has a lot to do with me being new to this so good luck with uh, using this kit and feel free to leave comments below if you have any questions